Hey y'all, SEMA 2017 and I got a 29 Ford sedan built by Rad Rods by Troy. And uh, it's been out in bare metal for a little while, but now it's all finished and it is way bad, exactly what you expect from them boys. Let me get the camera turned around, we'll take a quick look at it. What about that? That is just such a cool car. It toured around for a while in bare metal and it was way cool then too, but Unfortunately, I hate to say it, it has a GM. It's an all aluminum small block GM. I don't think it's an LS, could be, but it doesn't match. So for the longest time, you know, I don't want to shoot them if they don't match. Three inch stainless steel exhaust all the way back, hand fabricated chassis, look at that, would you? Man, but anyways, heh, it got the best of me. Will you look at it? I mean, this thing is just way cool, you know? all hand fabricated aluminum body you know the grill all handmade rad rods by troy they 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 turn out some very very cool cars handmade wheels one-off wheels no you know like center caps but no way of putting them on hand fabricated grill look at that roof that's aluminum you know, and you know me, I don't know nothing, but I, didn't they used to be canvas? Now, that is just way cool. Custom mix the paint. Yeah, you can't buy nothing on this car off the shelf. Nothing, nothing, nothing. And when it was in bare metal, I mean, you couldn't, I mean, it was gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Obviously, I'm kicking myself. I wish I would have taken at least a few stills of it at this point, but... Yeah, what are you going to do? Principle. It's all about principle. Custom torsion bar suspension front and rear. And then they use like a copper color on that. Man, just awesome. So classy looking too, right? So clean. And I just love the mechanics of that suspension. I guess that's how you, I don't know, you know, I mean, it doesn't, I want to say that's how you steer it, but I'm trying not to sound like an idiot. But that part back by the call, I think it has something to do with the steering. I could be wrong. You know me, what do I know? I know cool though, and you got to give it to me, right? That's just way cool. And I requested an interview um, through uh, through Facebook for Rad Ride, so you didn't have to listen to me yap about the custom interior. But uh, they are very busy. I understand that. But man, that is cool. I like what they did with the dash. It's got that center gauge, one gauge in the middle. It's actually got two. It's hard to see from this side. When we get over to the other side, you'll see there's actually two gauges there that are kind of centered in the middle. I did the best I could with lighting on that, guys. Well, at least we have a light, you know? Back in the day, we didn't have a light. It would have just been a black hole. I was shooting on the interior, but we really stepped up our game. <laughs> we got a light now. Don't know how to use it, but we have one. See, there's that other gauge. It's clean, you know, clean. Something that just looks like, and look how comfortable them seats look. And you just sit in it and cruise for days, drive it from here to California. Nah, I just really dug it. I thought it was a way cool car. Love the stance, love the wheels, love the color. Love, love, love. Just absolutely love this one. So there you go from the SEMA show 2017, 1929 Model A by Rad Rods by Troy. Hope you all have enjoyed it. See ya! Hey y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.